guys, AJ Piotrowski from Engearmate.com. And today I have these running socks from Swiftwick. These are the Maxxis Zero Tab. And I actually just got done a run in them. Um, and I've been running in these for, I don't know, about a month or so now. And have a bunch of miles, probably three or 400 miles. And I just a ton of time on my feet in on these. Um, so these are primarily designed for running. I think they also call out that they're good for golf as well. I, I wouldn't know, but I can definitely tell you about the running portion of these. Um, like any ultra runner or runner, you know, we all know that socks are super important um, for blister management, um, comfort, warmth, things like that. So I've been running these for a while, like I said, and I got these during the winter. So I ran a bunch of, a bunch of miles in them in colder conditions, um, wet conditions. Uh, I remember one run I did out in the NCR trail in Maryland. It was a pretty flat trail, but it was covered in, you know, real hard, icy snow in the beginning of the day. Uh, I ran a few miles in that, and then it started raining and the snow sort of loosening up. My feet were soaked, um, and these were completely wet. And I had zero blister issues. Um, this past weekend, I did a 20-miler in them, and then the week, two weekends before that, I did a 33-miler in them all on trail. And I haven't had any blister issues whatsoever. They're super comfortable. They dry really nice. Um, sorry if you hear that. My dogs are wrestling right over here. Um, you know, I also have washed these probably 10 times and have like very, very, I, I can't even see any wear or tear. No stretching, no fading. Um, overall, I just, you know, we're really happy with these. So a couple key features. Um, this band here on the arch, this arch band, is a real tight uh, a weave or sewn, but it keeps the sock in place. It doesn't move around, doesn't slip, doesn't slide, and just keeps it really comfortable. Um, I also like this seamless toe box. There's no lines, there's nothing for your foot to rub against. I mean, if you're running for, I ran, I think, almost eight hours in these one day. It, a lot can happen to your feet over eight hours. And you don't want any seams touching your toes, and th this is fantastic. So that, that's not happening. The stop blisters aren't happening. Um, some running socks, one complaint that I have with running general running socks is this tab in the back can be like super flimsy and kind of get stuck behind my heel or stuck in my shoe. This thing's firm enough, this back, but is you know comfortable. You can't you can't really feel it. But when you need it, it's right there. It's got this real tight elastic that keeps this up above the top of your shoe. Um, and finally, I love the fabric on the bottom of it. Um, it's comfy in the footbed. It dries fast. Um, and I thought that these were, you know, even though it was cold weather, were relatively warm. Now today I ran in them at 70 degrees out and my feet didn't feel like they were overly sweaty. Um, overall, I'm really happy with these. This is actually the first, I think it's the first pair of these, this brand socks I've ever ran in. I've been running for many, many years. I'm really excited about these socks and this brand. Um, and, you know, I'm just gonna pull the camera down here so you can see I have them on under my hocus here and you know you can barely see them um and you can see in the back here that you know, there's nothing sticking out um and they're just overall just a, a great comfortable sock um i would highly recommend checking them out uh and they're again from the swift swift wick maxis it's a mouthful thanks